Hi, this is Dina with Digital Hotcakes, and I am in Pinnacle Studio Ultimate Collection version 15. And I'm going to show you how to create a wedding title using the rings background and the revealed gold sparks from our Wedding Essentials Volume 1 in HD. Um, I've already brought them into Pinnacle Studio. It's very important when using any of our digital hotcakes that you copy them to your hard drive off of the DVD before bringing them into Pinnacle Studio. And also, our overlays that you will use from our HD products, well, from this particular HD product, are found on disc number three. They have a green background that's for use with the chroma key. So let's begin by dropping our rings background into the video track. And let's open our video toolbox and shorten this clip a little. We want to make it just six seconds. Okay, and then once we've shortened that clip, we can create our title. So let's select create or edit a title and we're going to create a motion title overlay and go ahead and set up your font and the size I'm going to use Valentine script and I'm going to make my size 76 and I'll go ahead and type our oops, go ahead and type our wedding I'm just going to grab this and drag it parallel to the shadow of the diamond there, right about there. Okay, and I also want to change the duration up here to six seconds to match the duration of our background. Okay, and I also want to change the color of the title, and I'm going to do that by grabbing this eyedropper over here, and I'm going to drop it in the gold color of the ring. Okay, and I'm going to increase the shadow on it a little bit too. Right here under si under shadow and size, I'm going to make this 110. There we go. Okay, we're not done with this title yet. We're going to we're going to add a motion to it. So we'll click on our motions tab right here. And we're we want to use a letters from left for the enter. Let's find that letters from left. I'm going to just drag it down there. And also we want that effect to only be a half a second long. So I'm going to just drag, grab its little slider bar and, and, and decrease it to a half a second. And while we're down here in the timeline, we also don't want this title to appear immediately. We want it to appear at one and a half seconds. So we're going to grab it and just drag it over to one and a half seconds. So we have our title coming in at one and a half seconds and we have that half second effect words from left on it right now. Okay. And we'll click OK. And we'll shut out our video toolbox. And now let's add our Reveal Gold Sparks. And we can do that just by dropping it over the overlay track where the title currently is. It's going to move that title down there, and I want this to be over at the one second mark as well. I'm going to grab it and drag it to one second. Okay, now let's select that layer and open our video toolbox. Let's try that again. There we go. <laughs> and let's go under Edit the Video Overlay using Picture in Picture or Chroma Key. The first thing we want to do is enable the Chroma Key because we want to get rid of all that green, so let's choose the chroma key tab and we're going to check this box here that enable chroma keying. Okay, let's go back to our picture and picture tab and right here under presets, let's choose full screen. And we want to grab this and drag it down a little bit. We're trying to line up those sparks so they're directly over our titles. So probably Take it down just a little bit, right about there ought to be good. Okay, we'll go ahead and close this tab. And the last thing we want to do is add a transition to our title track. The reveal is going to be revealing the title from the left. So we're going to put a wipe right on our title. And we'll do that up here under Album, Transitions. Here's the wipe right. <laughs> wipe right right here so let's go ahead and drop this on our title track 
All right, so we're finished. Let's see what we've created. 